The nominee to take over Japan's central bank could signal a winding down of that country's massive stimulus program that has made it a global outlier. The government of Prime Minister Fumio Kishida on Tuesday chose an academic with an MIT PhD, Kazuo Ueda. It's a surprise choice that could raise the chances of an end to the Bank of Japan's unpopular yield control policy, which tried to get people spending and businesses investing, but has crushed bank margins. Many investors expected the job to go to a career central banker. Markets have closely watched for Kishida's choice, for clues as to when the curve policy could end, and for the end of the decade-long experiment under incumbent Haruhiko Kuroda, where monetary policy tried to shock the nation out of its sticky deflationary mindset. It helped raise prices, but didn't create a lasting expansion as he had hoped. Ueda now faces the task of dismantling Kuroda's complicated and radical framework without derailing a fragile recovery, while trying to create the self-sustaining growth and wage rises for the Japanese people that Kuroda hoped for. On Tuesday, the country reported that it had avoided recession so far, but that its bounce back at the end of last year had been weaker than expected. The nominations of Ueda and two new deputies need the approval of both chambers of Japan's diet, but that's effectively a done deal since the ruling coalition holds solid majorities in both chambers.